Are YouTube shorts me the death of TikTok? Let's talk about it. There's been an arms race for short form content for a while, starting with Vine making uh, the short form content and revolutionizing the space. And then you come with Musical.ly, that, which becomes eventually TikTok. And then you have Instagram Reels, YouTube Shorts. But TikTok has dominated that space over the last three or four years now. Instagram Reels is kind of a flop. YouTube Shorts was a flop, but we're going to talk about why they have some potential going forward. So last week has announced that YouTube is monetizing Shorts with a 45% revenue split. That's kind of a big deal because finally monetizing people that are making Shorts can finally make money off their Shorts. Which you're getting millions of views and getting people millions of subscribers. But how much money is that actually? It's uh, right now on TikTok you have the Creator Fund, uh, which is two to four cents per thousand views. So a million viewed video is twenty to forty dollars. Nothing that exciting. But on YouTube, it's it's honestly it's going to be pretty similar because the forty five percent revenue split that H Hank Green discusses is that it's not a true forty five percent to the creators. Some of that forty five percent is going to go to music studios because a lot of shorts is music based so they get a split of that as well so you're not getting the full 45 percent from um from ads and similar to tiktok it's going to a fund which is then going to be split out to creators but overall it's going to be pretty close to tiktok's overall pay rate somewhere between three to five cents in my estimates um per a thousand views so nothing too drastic uh, and this, this is really going to help it's going to help more creators want to create content on youtube especially youtube creators but it's not going to really put a debt into the space right now it's not going to do anything to tiktok really but what is a big deal and what can make a splash in the space and maybe take some momentum away from tiktok is that there's been some articles coming out that youtube is going to start poaching tiktok creators by paying them bags just like what they've been doing with twitch i've been paying twitch creators big lump sums to come over from twitch streaming to youtube streaming and now they there's some rumors that they're gonna start doing with tiktok creators now is that gonna kill tiktok probably not but it's something that could make some changes in the in the short form content space. I mean, YouTube has been a content giant for years now. They've been around for many years. TikTok's still pretty new. So TikTok does have some changes they need to make. They, it is hard to make a living on TikTok. I, I mean, you see people all the time with 300,000 uh, followers on TikTok that get no money. But you have 300,000 followers on YouTube. You're probably doing that full time. So monetizing on TikTok is kind of difficult, and if you can secure more money over on YouTube, and obviously this news is not going to affect those people, but an overall space of YouTube, you, it's easier to make money there because uh, not only you have streaming revenue, you can make YouTube video revenue and now shorts revenue. There's a lot more monetization um, points where you can make a living and, and go full time into content creation. Well, on TikTok, you pretty much I mean, you can go live, but if you're just posting videos on TikTok. You need to be averaging millions of views per day just to be able to do it as a full-time job. So overall, I think it's something to pay attention to. Uh, maybe start making some YouTube shorts. I think it has a lot of potential now, especially with all this buzz going around it. Start making some shorts. They do get a lot of views. It does help your overall subscriber count. I personally need to make some shorts. Uh, I'm not sure what kind of shorts yet, but I need to make some, and I recommend you do too. Uh, but I will do it for this video, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out. Yeah.